how to sell nft art on OpenSea. hello guys welcome back to my channel i hope you all are doing well so in today's video i'm going to tell you basically how you can sell your nft art on OpenSea. so before any delay let's get to the video so uh I, here i have OpenSea.io open for me and as you can see this is their home page and if you scroll down OpenSea is a very good online uh you know nfts buying and selling platform it's a good crypto uh marketplace you can sell anything on OpenSea and you you can also buy you if you're a collector if you want to buy some nfts you can just come here and see what's trending what are on top there are very good collections nft has there are very good creators and very good sellers nft has you can just buy them as well and if you're a beginner if you want to basically create art and if you want to sell it as an nft you can just come here and list it and you'll be able to sell it for good money on nft so uh, when you come here this is the main profile and when you uh, come down a little bit these are the notable collections that OpenSea has as as you can see this is the tiny courses you know imaginary ones embrace your emotions kingship these are the notable collections that it has if you want to buy something you know notable uh, or if you want to just get inspiration from these people you can just click on any of this uh, art and just open it and have a look at it and for surely you'll know what they are into and what they're trying to create and then this is nft 101 this is uh, what are blockable gas fees how to buy an nft how to create an nft open c so nft also has their basics and also uh, you you know tell people uh, and make learn people how to do some simple stuff so you can just come here and if you are having any trouble if you have any queries you, you can just come here and open one of these sites and you'll be definitely be answered then if you want to browse by category if you want to have a you know specific category nft or if you want to even see them you can just come here and see all the categories that uh, OpenSea has it has art it has music it has trading cards it has photography utility virtual world sports domain names collectibles so now you see here you can basically turn anything into an nft the, the in the art section this is completely paintings and digital art and stuff in the music section these are basically some real some uh, you know musics of uh, maybe some old songs or something like that uh in the trading cards these are some trading cards in the photography even a simple picture of yourself can be turned into an nft so this is how amazing this is you can simply turn anything into an nft and uh, you know sell it and have money out of it so this is basically the whole game of selling nfts so what you're going to do today is basically we are trying to sell an nft of our own on OpenSea, and i'm going to show you what the process is so for that purpose first of all what you have to do is you have to basically create your own wallet or connect your wallet if you don't already have one so for connecting a wallet you have to basically come onto this wallet button here and you have to click on it and then you will be given some wallet options you have a wallet connect you have metamask you have coinbase and you have phantom i'm going with metamask because as you can see i already have a metamask uh, you know extension downloaded for me if you want to go with any other wallet if you have any other wallet just go with that one but if you just want to create a new wallet uh you know if you're if you don't have any wallet right now and you need to create one you can just create any one of them and connect it to your OpenSea because any nft uh you know any crypto uh, marketplace requires a wallet to connect to the side because this is how you make payments on uh, you know the crypto world you don't just go out with your bank ids and etc you will go with crypto wallets to pay money and to make transactions in crypto world so what you need to do is i'm just going to click on metamask right here so that i want to you know basically connect my wallet to my profile this is going to wait until this extension uh you know opens up it's opens up up as a different tab now it will ask me to sign the transaction or add in my password accordingly and then i will be able to sign in completely okay guys so after giving my password as you can see my wallet has been connected and it has 0.00 us dollars balance in it because it doesn't have i don't have any funds right now so i'm just going to close it from here and then i'm just going to click on this option here which says create so basically as i'm just going to create an nft so when you open this Okay guys, finally the page is open up of creating the NFT. This is says the create a new item. So now when uh, first you have to do is basically image or uh, video audio 3D model. You have to add an image of your NFT that you're going to sell in here. And these are the files supported by, uh, you know, OpenSea, JPG, PNG, GIF, SVG, etc, etc. You can see uh, these are all the files that are supported and the max size should be 100 MB. So it is, shouldn't be more than that. Then you have to add a name, a name for your NFT. You 
you have to add an external link if you have any site if you are selling nft somewhere else if you have any kind of site uh you know related to any kind of shop related to your nft you can just click on this one here and add an external link and then you have to provide a description for your nft so the description basically describes what you are trying to sell any buyer who is coming here wants to know that the creator knows what they're selling the creator knows the art that they're creating so you have to come here and add a good catchy description for yourself otherwise you won't look at authentic seller and the buyer won't be interested in buying your nft because they will see this person is not even uh you know not even able to describe his nft you know completely or and in a good stance then how should his nft be of any worth so this is very important that you add a very good description to your nft it should be um, meaningful it should be catchy it doesn't have to be an um you know piece of art or something but it should be good so you have to come here and a good description and it should be for uh, you know detailed it should be described because uh, a person reading a description would want to read something that is detailed a person uh, not interested in that would come here and read the description so please write it for the people who want to read the description so then you have to add the collection basically where your item will appear if you have a uh, if you're you know uploading it as a single item you can just go with that if you have a collection for your nfts you can just list it in the, that collection then you have to add properties level stats and you know now uh, you can just turn these on and then you have to supply and blockchain so this is how your whole thing works so now you need to basically create your new item so i'm just going to upload an image here and then i will tell you guys what are the steps that you need to do next okay so up, i uploaded an image it's a, just a random image that i found on google it's nothing like i haven't created my own i'm just doing it for the video purpose that i'm uploading it you cannot do that you cannot sell something that is already available on internet it's from google images or anything you have to make your own nfts so for that there are other videos um on this uh, youtube channel you can just go on and check them out if you want to but here now i'm just going to go on with the process for the name i'm just going to add abstract let's say i'm just going to you know name it abstract and then if i don't have any external links i'm just going to leave that option in the description i'm going to add colorful ab abstract just um you know for the sake of it because i'm not basically trying to actually sell it i'm just going to show you the process of the whole thing then you have to add it in a collection if you have a collection just click on that i have two untitled collections because i have to upload it nfts on my open sea already so i'm just going to click on any of the collection if you don't have a collection it will create a new one for you if then you have to add the properties textual straight that show up as rectangles you can add properties to your um you know uh, nfts properties are basically when you upload in a collection more than you know one nfts of the same kind but they have different properties like the, have you seen that ape nft and it has basically one ape has you know sunglasses on the other ape has a hat on these are the basically uh, differences between them so you can type these character like if i have a property that my ape is wearing a hat i'm just saying hat and then i'll name the male i'm the, the character that that ape is so this is how you add properties to your nfts if you're you know adding more in a collection you can add more properties as well by clicking on this option here i'm just going to leave it blank and then there are levels numerical traits that show up as progress bar you can add levels uh like if you you know the speed three or five you can add different kind of characteristics to your uh nft then you can add stats as well it has it shows us numbers and you know it is the same as stats show up underneath your item i click when then we filter it in your collectible collection sidebar so if anyone wants to filter it you can just add in the uh, you know stats here and it you will be filtered at three or five or you can say colors um it has colors how many colors does it have it has uh let's say um two of six or something like that three of six and you can say even just this is how your stats will be added the unlockable content include unlockable content that can only be revealed by the owner of the item if you want to add anything that is unlockable onto your nft you can just you know sign this in and then you need to enter the access key or code um, to redeem to into and link into a file so that anyone you want to share that unlockable content with will be able to do that then there is uh something that explicit and sensitive content if your content is for the 18 plus people you can just turn this uh, button on and then it won't show on the regular items and only the person's looking for and if they are you know if the owner is safe to see this kind of content it will only show up then you have to add the supply how many uh, nfts can be minted um, no gas cost to you you can make it supply as one i'm going to take it as one if you want to make it more you can just uh, you know have it and add a number like four or have a number like one i'm just going to 
give it as one then you have to enter your blockchain you can go with ethereum and you can go with the polygon or because any other option is not available for me right now so the problem with going with polygon is basically you have to pay the gas fees but polygon also pays good money but if you're going with ethereum we don't have to pay the gas fees but you will be a little bit you know short in money as compared to polygon so i'm just going with ethereum because i don't want to pay the gas fee because the gas fee basically keep, keeps fluctuating one day it is too much one day it is not too much so you cannot go with that one so i'm just going to go with this and i'm going to click on create so basically you have to enter the uh, recaptcha so that um they know i'm not a robot i'm just going to do that and then they're asking me to please wait i'm going to wait until it loads up okay guys so this is uh, my nft and it has been created as you can see these there are the details that i added and everything available now if i want to sell it i'm just going to click on this option and then i'll be able to add money to my nft if i want to sell it for fixed price i can just do that if you want to do it for timed auction i can do that as well i'm going with fixed price and i'm going to sell it for 0 0.002 ethereum and then that's it this is like 31.14 dollars in total so i'm just going to do with that the duration is five months and so service fees 2.5 percent creator fees zero and complete listing i'm just going to click on that and it will ask me to sign the transaction into your uh, metamask wallet and i'm just going to do that until it loads up okay my nft has been listed i'm going to view the listing and you'll be able to see how it looks like on the list it is the main picture then this is the price and you can you know this is the price history then you have your details your descriptions etc and this is how it looks like so this is how easy you can uh, you know sell your nfts on OpenSea. I hope uh, this video was informative for you. Please give this video a big thumbs up and keep watching my content. Until the next video, take care. Bye-bye.